Homer and doubled. He leads off the eighth. He's got it. This is like a right handed Alex Wood. <laughs> right? A little bit. <laughs> He's got a lot going on out there, that's for sure. <laughs> Doesn't he? Sends one out to Miles Straw and center. The wind's still blowing out toward the right field foul pole, but that's the first out of the eighth. Yeah, I wonder how that huge scoreboard in left field. That I mean, is, it covers the entire left side of the outfield. Yeah, I'm going to buy a new TV when we get home because this thing is. <laughs> I think it's the biggest in the big leagues. If it's not, I'm not sure which one. Dalton, a little late that time, got fooled on a break. In the sixth inning, in Nolan Jones with his back up against the wall, flying out to right, but Karen Chick gets out. Whoops! Yeah, it happens. Well, it looks like in this game, all the Indians pitchers, excuse me, the Guardians pitch. It makes the game go quicker. Plus, of course, you had the issue that Merrill Kelly had the other day when he kept trying to find a uh, receiver that would work. <laughs> a lot of changes for the Diamondbacks. That one missed in. Ooh. McCarthy on the run, the throw from Hedges, and he throws go. it into center field. McCarthy will get third base, and that's the go ahead run. Make them throw you out. Make them near that bag at third. Ooh. Aaron check almost threw that one at the backstop. At well, you can clearly see that little move that Karen Jack does before he goes into his delivery. He's holding the ball out in front of his belt and the first one ball and two strikes on Seth Beer. Pulls away from Hedges, but instead of going behind it, it curveball sailed on him, floats it upstairs, and now it's full. Three two. Got him. Went to the four seamer at 97. And strands that go ahead run at third. We are still tied in Cleveland. Wonder he had back trouble, <laughs> right? <laughs> James Karen Jack went to college right over the top. 95, he brings some gas. He's trying to float the curveball in there and then. Alton hits it right through the overshift. And it's a base hit to start the seven. Tommy, 89 pitches, 58 strikes. Rivera can't check. Offered at the curveball, and Karen check gets the strikeout. Oh, and a guy that. Marshall on the move. McCarthy swings through. No throw from Hedges. Count. No balls and two strikes. McCarthy gets it up into the wind. Miles Straw backing up, backpedaling to the warning track. Varsho at second. He'll tag up easily and head for third. There's the first pitch curve.
There it is again. And then the fast ball up. It's in there for a strike. 26 year old right hand. Guardians got a run in the first, three in the second, and that has been it so far tonight is the Astros. Astros team that is 36 and 21 on the road. And hundred Astros have been on in the American League West. And they've been on a run in this building too. Seven straight wins here at Progressive Field. They're going to keep that rolling. They're going to have to. Swing and a miss. 96 just above the zone, and there's one out here in the eighth inning. They were their total domination of their own division, the American League West. They had a lot of wins out of that, and that's what the Astros have done. At that outside corner. No ball. One on the ground. Tough play. What a play. Here's Altuve. Let's check in with Julia. Hey, Kevin, just wanted everyone. Today was the best day ever meeting Altuve, and Altuve sat with him for a long time, asked him a lot of questions about the game. Altuve's great. So is Paul. <laughs> On the line right here. It's in for a strike. It's two and one. First two games. Their team leads four to nothing tonight. Two two pitch. It's full. Strike three called. I cannot recall a better run for the starters as a group this year. I mean, it, it it's good. I'll tell you, it all started after they lost the first two against Houston, and then they they. Evened out the series, so it was timed beautifully. It might sound cliche. Tristan was just Tristan was just dynamite. Took it to another level. And now Bieber, you you want to play against them? That's where you test your metal. What does that say about ooh, what does that say about Tristan? His three best starts this season have been against the Astros and Yankees. Yeah, I mean he matched that start he had down, that he threw against them here on that broadcast. That's why <laughs> yeah. the game only was two and a half <laughs> hours. That's why. Well, Swing and a miss, and Riley Green goes down. I want to see Zach Plesac join that crew yeah. because obviously he's pitched into some. Zach Plesac had six walks. He had five his last time out. He yeah. said it's time to be yeah. aggressive. Go back. Trying to make quick work of the Tigers. And he did. Oh, oh my man, goodness. Wow. What's coming? Curveball misses. Ball one. Boy, that curveball bounced and he swung at it anyway. One on one. Or, yeah. I, I mean, that's the only thing I could think of. That one just missed. Two and one. And he hit it. Yeah. Right back to him and went by him and in, in the center field for a base hit. It just got on him quicker than he could react. And that's the second hit of the night at the plate. Yeah. He's saying that hit the knob. Could have had a run. Fastball misses up by He's just having a tough time. Fastball fouled. The 1 1.
chased a good curveball that was down. And the 2 2 is in the dirt. Full count. Swung on it, miss. He chased the ball at least half. Right field. Base hit. No, we'll stop him at 30. Goes through the stop sign. Now jams on the brakes late. And had Naylor cut that ball, they'd have had him dead at third, but he let it second. They're loaded for Eric Haas. And a fastball strike. He is one for three. He just rared back throwing smoke. That's back-to-back -back fastballs of Haas. The 0-2 curveball is up and away. He's loaded. One out. One-two pitch. In the dirt. Nice block by Hedges. And now it's back. And the choo-choo, he just got a piece of it. Here's the choo-choo. Full count. He awaits the 3-2 pitch. And popped back out of play. Blew it by him at 96, and now there are two down. And Karinchek fires a curveball high. September the 2nd, getting his first opportunity. And he earned it. It's not like they just called. Karinchek with a 1-1, and a foul right back to the screen. And that... The 1-2. Up high. 2-2. Two, two. Struck him out with a curveball. Oh, Uncle